Hey guys, so um, I just finished cooking and it's like 3 in the morning and um, my hair is crazy, well it's going crazy all over again and I wasn't feeling very well so I had to take some of my medication, uh, my pain medication. So. I apologize if this video is kind of slow, and um, I apologize if I'm talking quiet or something, but I got another uh, vlog request, and I said that I would try to do these as fast as I could. Um, I actually got two. One is for CPR, and the other is for a response to... Onision's um, Joker versus the Rubik's Cube video. So um, I actually messaged the person for the CPR video back asking precisely what they want me to do in the video. Because um, I could do a number of things. I could make up something. <laughs> I can, um, I could demonstrate CPR. I could just discuss the steps for it. Um, I could go over the history of it. I, I would have to look that up. But I can do it. So I asked them exactly what they're looking for in the video. So for now, I'm going to hold on that one until I find out exactly what they want so that I can do my best to fulfill what they are looking for in my response. But for the one with the Joker versus the Rubik's Cube, um, I want to start off saying that, personally, I really like Onision's videos. I think he's a really funny guy. Um, and I think he's a good person, just based off of uh, what I feel like I get from his, his nature as a person. Um, and from some of his more serious videos, meaning like the things that he talks about outside of doing skits. So I think he's great. Um, the Joker versus the Rubik's Cube, I think it was funny. Um, and it was like a good, first of all, the makeup was amazing. He really did look like the Joker. Um, the, the, screenshot that you see before you click on his video to play I I didn't know that was Onision I didn't realize that until I went to the video page and saw his thing up you know uh, above the video saying Onision and you know below it and everywhere and um, until I played the video and recognized him um, but as a still frame, the shot that he has as the thumbnail looked exactly like Joker, in my opinion. Um, also, I thought that the entire concept of the Rubik's Cube versus the Joker was funny. But, the only problem that I had with the video, not that this is a big deal at all, was that I don't think that the Joker would... <laughs> um, react that way to the Rubik's Cube. Um, I honestly I don't even think he would be bothered with it, but I don't really know because I'm not the Joker and it's not like I have any close personal ties with him or anything. But um, I did think it was funny that he decided to like break it all apart. I would totally do that. I have a friend who actually did that with a Rubik's Cube. It was a special Rubik's Cube though. It wasn't the colors. It was actually four different, or, oh wait, no, not four, wait. how many sides does a Rubik's Cube have? Six. Six different, um, six different pictures. And so that made it even harder, but he's, like, this Rubik's Cube junkie and loves it, so I thought that was cool. But, um, he actually solved it, um, without taking it apart, but he did take apart a different one. Um, 
and like I saw it all in pieces and I wanted to know how he got it apart and I, you know I, I kind of wonder if he broke it and decided that he wanted to pretend that he was taking it apart on purpose but who knows um I do think that the Joker if he decided to mess with the Rubik's Cube would be able to solve it without breaking it apart but for all intents and purposes of the skit that Onision did, I think that that was a pretty good video. Um, I don't think it was one of his best, only because it wasn't as crazy and random as I, as I feel like he usually is, um, which is why, I, well, not the only reason, but part of the reason that I really like his videos. Um, but I do think that it was a really good, that he did a good job with the, uh, playing the part of the Joker. Um, he did kind of mess up on the voice every once in a while, but for the most part, he actually had it down pretty well. I think he, uh, uh, oh, um, I'm just gonna, I guess, kind of shout out to Onision. I think that you should have, um, licked your lips a little bit more because the Joker seems to always lick his lips, which is kind of gross. I don't understand how he doesn't get paint and stuff all over his tongue. Um, and also, usually when you're, like, constantly licking your lips, like, all around, you tend to get, like, it gets really raw. Like, the skin gets really raw and irritated and red. And it, it, it cracks and it's, it's supposed to hurt really badly. Kind of like if you have a cold and your nose is constantly running and you're always, like, wiping your nose with the tissue over and over and, like, blowing your nose eventually you notice that like it starts to hurt right there like it gets raw it's, it happens the same way with your with licking your lips except for that it's um well it's not necessarily worse it's actually pretty close to the same because with the <laughs> with the snot um there's a wetness um that kind of like because it's usually you get a cold when it's cold outside Usually, with the cold, dry air, it it also kind of dries out your skin. But, like, that's why they have lip balm, because it moisturizes your skin, kind of like, you know, lotion. But if you just keep licking your hands, or, like, well, and this is, like, an example because of the lotion. If you just keep, like, rinsing your hands with water every time they feel dry, they're just going to dry back out. Like, the water's just going to go away. Same thing with your spit around your lips. It's the, it's the same concept, it just makes it more dry in the end. So, um, but, I, but I still think he should have tried licking his lips um, a little bit more, just because the Joker seems to do that a lot. And like I said, I don't know why the Joker doesn't have messed up lips, like a uh, really messed up uh, mouth area where he licks a lot. Um, but yeah. You know, I've always wanted to um, try, like, the Joker makeup just to, just because it's epic, pretty much. And uh, I think a lot of people have either tried it or want to, or plan on doing it, or, you know, maybe you're too scared to do it. I know I am. I don't even know what I would do. And I'd probably look silly. But maybe one day, and maybe one video, I might do it. Perhaps. No promises. But, um, yeah. So that's my opinion on the Onision Joker vs. Rubik's Cube video. And if you guys want to watch it, I'm going to put a link um, in the description bar. Um, so, yeah, look for that. Um, I'm not going to say where the description panel is because... It's gone from being on the side of the screen to being on the bottom. And, you know, who knows where it's going to end up next. So I'm not even going to bother telling you where it is. You'll find it. Um, I'm pretty sure most people know where it is by now. And uh, I'm sure you guys are all smart and pretty YouTube savvy. So I'm going to head out, guys. Thanks for watching. Ciao.